but it is what it is. It's your boy Tacos and Workouts. And, uh, you know, we're, we're going to do an episode today for one more Taco TV. That's right. And, uh, you know, this is the place. Welcome to the beautiful city of Long Beach, California. Today we're going to visit La Taqueria number two. That's right, number two. Let's go get some tacos. What it is, what it is with another episode. My name is JR. And I'm up to the challenge. I'm looking for the best tacos there is. Stay tuned to this episode of Best Tacos. And let's see what we find. This is Tacos and Workouts. Alright guys, so unfortunately we cannot eat tacos at the location because they had no outdoor dining. But it's okay, we're because we're gonna have them at home. Alright guys, in order for you to kind of recognize if it's a good place or not, this is what I do. I get a carne asada taco and a al pastor taco. And that's kind of how I gauge whether it's a good taqueria or not so good. So uh, that's just uh, what I do. And what do I do? I look for the best tacos, wherever they may be. So with that said, let's eat some tacos. Okay, since I could not see in the back how they were making um, the tacos, I don't think that Pastor was, was done with the trompa. I think it was done like uh, on la parrilla, on the grill. Um, it doesn't look like what a regular um, al Pastor taco would look like. Um, it doesn't have the right coloring, but it has the grill done in. So, um, you know, it doesn't matter what it looks like. It matters what it tastes like. Okay, so um, it doesn't look like what your regular al pastor meat will look like. Um, it does have some good seasoning there. Um, the grilled onions help the taco out a lot. It's a good taco. All right, guys. So it's time to try the asada taco. Um, the asada meat looks what it's supposed to. It comes with regular onions and cilantro. We added lime to add more flavor to the taco. And we added green salsa to give it a more of a pop. You know, so, so you could taste that carne asada meat. All right, guys. So these are authentic Mexican tacos. That's right. These are as close to what you would consider Mexican tacos. They don't play around. Nothing fancy, but just good tacos. Let's have another as Frank will take one more taco for a fun boy. All right, guys, it's time to talk about tacos. Um, so we had the El Pastor taco. It didn't look what your normal El Pastor taco would look like. They didn't have that like red meat kind of look to it. Um, I don't know how they made it. I couldn't get behind the kitchen. But it's okay um, because it's not how it looks. It's, it's how it tastes, right? So that taco um, we had grilled onions, uh, cilantro, we put lime on it, and, and salsa verde. And that salsa verde, it was spicy, and it complemented the taco very well. It wasn't so spicy where, where it, it overtook the taste of the taco. It was a really good taco. Uh, we liked it a lot. Um, 
and we were quite surprised. It was actually better than their asada taco. We, we liked it a lot more. Nothing wrong with their asada taco. It just didn't have that pop that we were looking for. Um, was this a good place to eat tacos? Yes, it, it's, it's a very good place to eat tacos. I'm definitely going to be stopping by and checking them out again. Um, so if you guys happen to be in the city of Long Beach and you want to look for a nice little authentic Mexican taqueria, um, La, La Taqueria number two, um, it's a spot to, to stop by, man. Check it out. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. I'll see you on the next.